wedding planning. We've been engaged now for about three weeks and I haven't had a whole lot of time to do too much wedding planning. I've done a little bit of research and just contacting venues, but since I work full time and Brandon works full time also, we haven't had that much time to do stuff, but we already made a pretty solid guest list and I've been in touch with a ton of different venues, so today we're finally touring one in the Orlando area, and I really hope we like it. Um, at first, it wasn't really on my radar as some place that I would even consider, so I'll be interested with how I feel about it when I see it in person. It's really pretty, but most, number one, most of it is outdoors, so that just makes me a little nervous because the weather in Florida is just so wild. You never know when it's going to be sunny or rainy and whatnot. So, but since we're planning a spring wedding, that does ease my mind a little bit because it definitely rains a lot less in the springtime. So, we'll see. We'll definitely update you on how we feel after we tour it. And then after that, we're probably going to go look at wedding rings for the groom. Since he already has mine, I want to pick out one for him. So that's our plans for the day. And then we might start apartment hunting as well for after we get married. So I'm really excited. It's going to be a good day. Obviously there's tons online and on Pinterest, but I like these. 
And this one's for an orange blossom bread, which is Orlando. So, super fun. I think we might look at some other places, but maybe not. We've done a lot today. Hey friends, back to where we started this morning. So today was a really fun day touring a venue and getting lunch with my fiance and then going ring shopping. I just, I never expected this to be, I never expected wedding planning to be so in depth. I know there's a lot of decisions you have to make and a lot of choices, but never expected it to be this tricky. There's just so much to consider when like, choosing a venue especially so yeah I'm so glad we went to visit the acre in real life so I could really see it and we could just get a better idea of what it's like and I love that Brandon loves it because that makes me love it even more and I definitely think it has a lot of strong potential but there's just some things to consider and of course there are hesitations with it being outside and stuff and I don't know there's just so much I feel like for a venue I should just know automatically like this is the one kind of like getting married you know this is the one but then again it's just like the place and you can really make it your own and it does kind of have that blank slate appeal because there's so much you can do with it and the people who own it are really flexible and um, pretty much up for anything so I really like that and we can bring in all our own vendors and I do have moments where I can picture our wedding so easily there but then I have other moments where I'm like oh, what if it rains or like I'm just wondering where it could because I kind of want to do a first look also if you don't know a first look is um it's where the bride and groom see each other before the wedding and they get to have like the surprise moment of seeing each other for the first time so um I kind of want to do that with Brandon because I heard from a lot of people that you it's like two special moments because you get to see each other for the first time and then when I walk down the aisle, obviously that's special as well. So I don't know. It seems kind of fun to do that, but we'll see. So again, like I said, tons to consider, but I hope this was fun for you guys to watch. And I'll definitely be filming lots of other wedding, venue, wedding, <laughs> wedding related videos soon. Let me know if you have any suggestions. Next week, I'm actually going to a bridal show in Orlando on Sunday. So I'll probably vlog that because I really want to document this time in my life and hopefully it's helpful or fun for y'all to watch. So I'll talk to you guys soon and have a beautiful day. Bye. I told you.